I chose to come to Bellingham Technical College because I love the programs, the diversity. Our instructors here are great. Both of them just do an outstanding job making sure we comprehend and fully understand everything they're thrown at us. I spend my days trying to get our students to absorb as much information as possible before they go into the workforce. We have people from the welding department come down every once in a while and, hey, can you do this? And we hand those projects off to our students so they get the real life experience of, you know, working on somebody else's print. When you do get a job in the industry, you're going to be making somebody else's parts. I can go to an employer and say, I know how to run a mill, I know how to run a lathe, I can program G-code in the CNC machines. So I have real solid skills. It's a really amazing experience to watch them program something in Mastercam, bring it out here onto the floor and then run it on the Mazak or the Haas. It's really a unique experience to see the joy in their face. If you can hold it in a workpiece, you can make it. We've been provided with an aerospace grant that has allowed us to purchase some of the amazing equipment that you see. We draw up in SolidWorks, you can program it in Mastercam, come out here on the floor and run the part. There's not a lot of places where you get to see every level of machining happen. I find myself thriving. I see that I'm able to do anything that these guys do. And it just amazes me that there's not more women in here because it's a fun job, it's a great job. It's challenging, but it has so much opportunity for growth and creativity. I would encourage any woman be a part of this. There's no doubt in my mind if someone dedicates themselves to this, they will have a job, a fine career that will make them a real wage. This field is definitely in demand and growing. There's all kinds of opportunities in small shops or larger manufacturing facilities. You can go into aerospace, you can go into making prosthetics, there's machinists that do dental work, there's refineries, there's really no limit on what you can do with this education.